Star Slayer here, and I have a really cool subscription box this month. I have Wow Box. And this is the Japanese candy subscription box. Prices for Wow Box vary. It goes from $15 a month for their small up to $35 a month for their large. The small box is gonna have six to 10 items per box, whereas the large can have up to 11 to 13 items per box. But this one in particular caught my eye because it was a kawaii and beauty box. This is more of healthier Japanese snacks along with some beauty products, which is like, it seems kind of random. So I thought I would give it a try. Um, as you can see, this box is freaking huge. This is the large box. And there is like so much stuff in here. You guys can see, there's a sneak peek at some of the items that are inside here. And it comes with this chart here to show you what the different candies are, tells you a little description of each one. It also comes with nutrition facts, which is really nice because a lot of the nutrition facts on the back are in Japanese, so it's really good that they actually put English um, nutrition facts on there for people. First one is chocolate filled Hanover? Hen I can't pronounce this. I don't know what this is. It's chocolate filled something. It looks like it's got Hello Kitty characters on it. They look like little chocolate puffs. It's like, they're like ripe puffs with some chocolate on the inside. It's actually really good. This is so cute. This like a little corgi on the package. This is Happy Niku Q Gummy. These are great flavored. Actually, the ones that I had before, I actually had one like this before, but it was peach flavored. And those were actually really good. They're like little dog paws. They're super soft. Really good. Uh, the next thing inside, it looks like Purell gummy, which is aloe and blueberry flavored. I've had aloe flavor stuff before and didn't really like it. So I'll see how this goes, because I like blueberry. Aloe ones are little squares and blueberries look like little um, kisses shape. That was actually really good. I, I normally don't like aloe stuff, but I like that one a lot. I can't pronounce this. I don't... Perunto Konyaku Jelly. It's peach flavored. I know I'm butchering these names. I know it. I'm really sorry. There's nothing I can do, but yeah, that's what I thought. Not so good. Um, I love peaches, but I just don't normally like peach flavored um, drinks or candies or anything like that. So um, I'm not a fan of this one. It's so good. Jizo Pits. Okay, I cannot pronounce these things. Uh, Kiriana Konshaku. This is blueberry and cherry flavored. Here's what they look like, little crunchy things. Wow. Like, I was expecting a little hint of it, but when I bit into it, it was just like flavor blast. It's really good. And I actually don't need the translator for this one. I can do this without any pronunciation problems. So this is a Pokemon pretzel. It's a little Pikachu Pocky. Looks like it's cookies and cream flavored. It is cookies and cream flavor. It's actually really good. All right, so next up we have this uh, Horatikita. Uh, this is choco banana. Uh, this is one of those do-it-yourself type kits. So it looks like some sort of little banana type snack that you just dip into chocolate and sprinkles and it looks delicious and I'm sure it is, but I don't have time to do this right now, so I'm not gonna do that. And we have Osatsu snack. Uh, this is a potato chip, which is supposed to be a little bit healthier than normal. Here's what it looks like. It's like really uh, thin and airy feeling. So I like that it's more airy than like a regular potato chip, but the flavor is so light. It doesn't really, it's not satisfying. And this is a really big bag here. This is a caramel corn. This is cherry flavored cherry flavored. It looks like shrimp. Like the little picture on the front here, it looks like it is little shrimp. I was kind of scared at first. So here's what it looks like. It's kind of like a little mini Cheeto puff. It's actually not bad. It's a little strange, but it's not bad. <laughs> so this, if you didn't know what this was, I could easily see somebody going to a store and just buying this thinking, oh, it's Hello Kitty. Okay, like, it's gotta be candy, right? Because when you look at it, it looks like it's 
Hello Kitty candy. But despite the appearance of these, which look very much like candy, these are supposed to be cough drops. I can tell you this though, you can definitely tell it's a cough drop when you put it in your mouth. It, it tastes like, like halls or something like that. Usuyaki salad. Um, these are basically, uh, these are rice crackers. Here's what they look like here. You can see it's all, uh, there's individual sections, which is really nice. So they don't go stale as quick. I don't like, it's just like super salty. Um, it's not really my cup of tea. And the last thing inside, I know I'm gonna butcher this, it's a real Akuma card and sticker. This is so tiny. So it comes with the little bear here, little stickers, and like, I think it's like a little sticky pad here. So you can stick it on something. So I'm not quite sure what they meant by beauty products. I guess I thought they meant something more physical, like some sort of actual, like something for your face, like a mask or under eye cream or something like that. I think that's what I was thinking when I read beauty products. I'm not quite sure what they had in mind when they said that, as I don't think I saw any actual pictures of examples of the beauty products. But I am a little bit bummed out because that was a big reason why I opted for this package. Um, but still, um, a lot of these snacks are lower calories. I like pretty much everything that I got. I thought everything tasted pretty good with the exception of the, this little peach drink here. I wasn't a fan of that. And then these are a little too strong for me, but I know I can find other people that are a fan of this. So it's not a total waste. It's still cool nonetheless. And if you guys thought this was cool, you're gonna wanna go to Wildbox. I have a link in the description box below as well as a code that'll save you guys 10%. So if you guys wanna get this and save some money in trying it, go down to the description box below to look for that link and code. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.